we in focus? I really hope we are in focus. Are we in business? What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. Everybody's saying that on their YouTube channel so I might as well say it on mine. Welcome, welcome to my channel. Um, my name is Caitlin Ascara. Um, I had, <laughs> this is, I'm sorry if I'm like a little flustered. Uh, this is like my third time filming this video. Um, it's currently um, 9.04 and I've been filming this video since um, oh my gosh, I thought I wasn't filming. I was about to start screaming. Um, I have been filming this video since I woke up 12, so, um, <laughs> yeah, alright. I don't know what that was. Anyway, <laughs> I'm, um, filming, uh, what? Okay, this is where I'm at right now. I'm like, I'm like saying the same things over and over again today. Um, okay, I, the last time I filmed this video, the whole thing was not in focus at all so yeah all right um this video is gonna be a little body positivity um you know something to like help those girls out there who aren't exactly feeling summertime fine who aren't at their weight goal goal weight you know what i'm trying to say who aren't where they want to be you know but you know they need a little confidence booster for the summer this is the confidence booster y'all need okay i well, let's start with my story. I um, have been <sighs> I've never been skinny. Let's start. Let's start. Like let's let's start. Let's just dive right in. Let's just get to where we need to be. I've never been skinny. Um, I think the only time I was skinny was when I was born when I was a baby. Uh, then I discovered I like food too much, and it just it took off from there. So um, yeah, elementary school, high school, super insecure. Got made fun of in, in elementary school, and then I like developed this like hard exterior, uh, this this toughness, this tough persona um, in high school, and I would literally always look mean. I would look, I would <laughs> be like, you know what, fight me, bro, fight me, like like what's up? Uh, <laughs> because I was insecure, and I was that was kind of like my defense mechanism. Um, but yeah, I would get made fun of in, high, in elementary school, and. Um, Whenever I did go to the beach or whenever I did go to the pool, it would always be um, a one piece. And whenever I did wear a two piece, that girl would be like, it would be a very high waisted bikini. Like it might as well have been a two piece. Just want to make sure I'm gonna focus. Yeah, it was a very very high waisted <laughs> bikini. Um, I think in I think just being a kid and like especially in high school. Um, everybody's insecure, I feel like. Um, I think it's because teenagers, and I'm literally just, like, realizing that this is not true, but, and I'm a sophomore, I'm about to be a sophomore in college, but literally, like, in high school, um, your anxiety is heightened so much, and you feel like everybody is watching you, everybody cares what you're doing, everybody's, like, looking closely at your every move, everybody wants to know what's good, like, what's up with you. But that's not the case at all, and I'm literally just realizing this. Like, I'm gonna let y'all in a secret, like, literally, be very close. I'm gonna zoom in on this, because I want y'all to hear this secret. Y'all ready for this? Nobody cares. <laughs> Nobody cares. Nobody cares about you or what you're doing. Literally, nobody is looking at you that close. Like, that's all in your head. It's all in your head, girl, like, nobody cares. <laughs> And I don't know why it took me so long to realize that, but it it, it, it took me a long time and I'm still realizing it. Um, but yeah, I used to be so insecure, so self, so insecure about my body, about myself, about who I am. It's just a whole thing. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I, this summer I wanted to wear some bikinis, so I ordered three bikinis from Fashion Nova. Fashion Nova, please sponsor me. Anyway, no, I'm joking. No, I'm serious. I'm dead serious. Sponsor, sponsor me, Fashion Nova. Hook girl up. Anyway, oh my god. I'm sorry, guys. I told you this is like my third video, third third time filming this video. I'm tired. I'm probably not even going to edit this, so I'm sorry. This is what you get. <laughs> this is what you're getting. But, um, anyway, yeah, I used to be so insecure. Uh, reason number one, I think it's because 
I would not monitor what I allowed myself to take in. Um, before... I have gained some um, more confidence than I than I did it than I I've, I've gained confidence since you know high school years, um, and I it's because I've realized it's because what I allow myself what I allow this device to put into myself um, on Instagram especially I would follow a lot of accounts where it was like it was it was skinny girls it was skinny um, it was skinny white girls it was a lot of people that I would follow like that and it was like that whole tumblr fla uh the whole tumblr phase i don't know what that whole thing was when you'd be like eh, i don't know what that was y'all don't want to talk about and you just take those weird angles i don't know what that was that that was the time where i was following all those accounts and and i would see um all these girls getting love and people just like really appreciating and glorifying these these girls and how they looked and then I didn't know, I didn't realize at the time what it was doing to my self-esteem because all these girls that I was following, all these girls that I was putting as my idol, I looked nothing like. <laughs> and I would try to strive and, and be what they were because I see everybody putting them on a pedestal, but I didn't have any idols that looked like me, that, that kind of maybe go through the same struggles that I do. I wasn't, I wasn't looking for that. And so I didn't know it at the time, but, um... I was kind of allowing them, just just idolizing those people, I was, it was kind of negative to my life because I didn't have anybody to look up to that, um, that looked like me, that, anyway, um, once I started following, once I started reevaluating myself and reevaluating who I was following, who I was allowing to speak words into my life, who I was like, you know, who I was allowing to, to be in my life, like on social media and stuff. Once I reevaluated that and started following more body positive accounts, more, you know, more people that looked like me who had the same body type as me, uh, like um, people like Letitia Thomas and Ashley Graham, Jordan Woods, love those three women. Those are my idols. Um, yeah, I think that's the key to being confident in yourself right now is monitoring and being aware of what you're allowing yourself to see. I think that's a very key element in being confident in who you are right now. Um, another little tip, I don't know what this video is, I, think it's, I, I don't know, I think it's just me ranting or, I don't know. But another like little tip <laughs> into being confident um, for the summertime and being confident in your body is I think just fake it till you make it. Um, I am in nowhere, I'm not super confident in my body right now. I love my body, I'm starting to love my body, I'm starting to love me for who I am, but I'm not where I wanna be. I mean like weight wise, I'm not where I wanna be. So, um, but even though I'm not where I wanna be right now, I think it's super, 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 super important that people love their self no matter what stage they're in, no matter what stage their body is in, they need to love themselves regardless, you know? And that's what I'm starting to do. I'm still trying to lose weight, but I'm also trying, but I'm also trying to love myself now, not when I lose the weight. Loving myself throughout the process is what I'm trying to do right now. So, um, yeah, the reason I bought those bikinis because I was trying to fake it till I made it. I I wanted I want to I wanted to show some skin this summer. That's why I bought those bikinis. Um, I posted. I went to the beach. I wore one of the bikinis. I posted one of the pictures on Instagram. Some bikini pictures on Instagram. It was super scary because I feel like for the first time that was me being real with my followers. That was me being real for the first time on my Instagram. Um, that was my body, that was who I am, that's my current state right now, and I just feel like I'm so used to face tuning and doing all this other stuff, but I've never, that was me being real, and it, it's, it's scary being vulnerable, vulnerable, but it's also really satisfying, and I don't know, it's empowering, so, yeah, I just think, I just wanted to make this like little, I don't, I th I'm thinking this is a rant video, but I just wanted to make this video because I want everybody to realize that they're beautiful just the way they, they're beautiful right now like all women no matter what size just like Ashley Graham says beauty beyond size 
you're beautiful right now and then you need to cherish yourself in the moment and love yourself during the different stages of your life not just where not just when you get to the goal or the goal weight or, or not just when you get to the goal that you want to be um yeah and I just want everybody to live their life unapologetically this summer wear what you want to wear <laughs> no matter what size you are nobody care like even if even if somebody cares just just wear what you want to wear this summer be you do you don't focus on anybody else do everything because you want to do it and not try to please anybody else and just live your life this summer and just I don't know have fun I felt like I don't know why I wanted to talk about that but I just did um yeah do you <laughs> that's all I want to say I don't know how to end this video but um thank you guys so much for watching this video this was so random weird um I know um I don't know let me let me know I'm so tired I'm sorry let me know down below what you guys what other videos you guys want to see from me um please I need ideas let me know um help a girl out uh and I will be posting another video soon thank you for watching <laughs>